I'm Jackie Weaver. Thanks for joining me for more in this month's Friday Night Spotlight devoted to Australian cinema. It's a night of premieres on this last Friday of May and up next we have the first Australian film to receive international recognition. Directed by Ken Hannam in 1975, it's the historical drama Sunday Too Far Away. Like our last film, Newsfront, this next one also takes place in Australia of the 1950s. But instead of following newsreel reporters, Sunday Too Far Away takes a look at the hard-working lives of sheep shearers and the politics involved in their industry. Heading the cast is Jack Thompson, the same actor who played the unsuccessful lawyer in the film which launched our festival four weeks ago, Breaker Morant. Jack's performance in this film, Sunday Too Far Away, earned him the Australian Film Institute's Best Actor Award for 1975. Joining him are Max Cullen, a familiar face to Australian television fans and live theatre goers since the 1960s, and John Hewitt, who played Charlie in Newsfront. It's a wonderful movie, directed brilliantly by Ken Hannam. Over his 40-year career, Hannam worked mostly in television, making only five feature films. In fact, when I was still a schoolgirl, Ken Hannam directed me in the 1964 TV drama Split Level, and the following year he gave me my first lead in the TV series Wangina. But with this next movie, Ken Hannam helped shape serious Australian filmmaking from 1975 and with a title that comes from a verse from the old Australian poem The Shearer's Wife's Lament, Friday Too Tired, Saturday Too Drunk, Sunday Too Far Away, here's director Ken Hannam's feature film debut, Sunday Too Far Away. <laughs> 